All right, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Solinux Crypto. And uh, this is uh, the last video of this morning for me. Uh, we're covering Solana. We'll take a look at, uh, at, at Sol. We'll do a full analysis of what's going on. Yesterday, obviously, we got some, some bullish momentum coming mainly from Bitcoin. So we'll talk about the effects of that on Solana. And also just in general, what that uh, what's expected from the price right here. Because we're actually, it might not look that way. Uh, but Solana right now is actually at a, a very crucial point of, uh, of of price where we could actually get a bullish breakout and and get some sort of stability between 25.5 and 23 dollars ultimately or we could confirm the downtrend move down to 22 dollars and uh, after that probably down further so yeah pretty crucial but that's what we'll talk about in this video of course before we dive into Solana specifically though I do want to mention that I have my own premium trading group Links will be down in the description or the pinned comment, or you could just head on over to selenix.com where you can actually find out more information about what you get in terms of perks when joining, uh, the trading strategy I use, which I will also teach in the trading guide and all of my, my trades, which I, which I share, are based on that. And you can also join via the website. All right, so if that's, uh, if, if that's interesting to you, check that out, but for now onto Solana. So like I said, Solana yesterday around this point of time when I when I posted a technical analysis on Telegram was not looking that great. It actually looked like and you can see that right here. It looked like we were breaking down below the 200 EMA, uh, which was the main support level, which was holding us up. But then bullish momentum from Bitcoin started really with with this candle right here. We actually were saved, I would say, by Bitcoin um, and we managed to to get some bullish momentum. But in the end, and most of you will probably also see that on the chart already. In the end, we just respected the downtrend. You, you can kind of see <clears throat> that ever since those highs we made on the 15th of July, there's basically this, been this, this bearish momentum that's been pushing us down. And then, you know, in, in the end, $23 has held us up pretty well. So there's some sort of a, a hidden structure, I would say. Um, well, it, it's not even that hidden, but <laughs> it's, uh, it, it was hidden to me first. Because you have this, this bearish momentum pushing us down. And then the main support is this 200 EMA. I would not even say that it's a $23 level per se. I would say it's the 200 EMA. So the big question now is, is which one of those will break earlier? And I have to say is that, you know, Solana yesterday almost already broke through that level. Almost already got that bearish breakout. Then was saved by bullish momentum from Bitcoin. But Bitcoin right now, even though we found quite a lot of support at the support level at 29,400. It does look like this was, at least for now, I mean, we still have to wait for confirmation. If Bitcoin breaks above 29,700 now, Solana will follow and Solana will be bullish. But it looks like this was more of some sort of a closure of shorts or, or some sort of a, a fa fake bump or so, of some sorts, because it looks like we're, we're giving up 29,500 as a support immediately after the pump we had or at least well the, the morning after and if that happens if we drop down below that level then we'll get more bearish momentum down to 29,000, and uh, and solana will just follow what it was doing yesterday and then altogether i mean this this bearish trend is quite strong uh, and that whole bearish market structure battling against one key level usually the market structure wins them uh, even though it, it takes some uh, even though it takes some some convincing so i think it's more likely that at some point of time we'll break down below our main support level which right now is between 23.25 and 23 dollars we'll get that bearish breakout we'll do a retest and then drop down to 22 dollars which is an amazing support i expect support from there and from there we'll see again all right but that's what i expect uh, I think this is most likely unless Bitcoin gets a lot of bullish momentum from here. That's what we'll see. If that does happen, I'll keep you updated on that. But for now, it's my take on Solana. So thank you for watching. Take care and bye.